Okay, welcome to this uh, update on this planet uh, because we have a, had another earthquake uh, that I want to tell you about uh, that uh, has happened here. Uh, we, there was one in a terrible one in Puerto Rico, as you know, uh, but this one was actually felt in the United States. It was felt in Florida and it was large at 7.7, magnitude 7.7. So this happened on January 28, 2020. A magnitude 7.7 uh, 7 earthquake struck in the Caribbean Sea, roughly equidistant from the coasts of Cuba, uh, Jamaica, and Cayman Islands. Seismic, seismic instruments immediately detected the earthquake that originated at a depth of about 6.2 miles. And so because of this, uh, uh, the, despite the large size of the earthquake, it occurred offshore and away from high population areas and lessened its impact. However, uh, there was a concern about tsunamis. I know that. So let's see if we can find out some more information about this earthquake here. Uh, so uh, this is an interactive map. Um, uh, let's see. We'll go to the map, I guess. So this is where it happened, right over here. Uh, and uh, it was felt even in parts of Florida, which is crazy. Uh, now, as far as damage goes, I haven't heard about much, so we're just looking at Twitter because I have, again, the mass media is kind of like not really talking about it too much, but uh, take a look at this. This is not good. The ocean in the middle of the road, uh, and uh, that uh, that could be tsunami damage right there. So it uh, could have been a tsunami from this uh, earthquake here. Uh, and let's see. This is, uh, yeah, you can see some action there on the water there. Uh, fortunately, it does not look like there's too much damage, but it did cause some tide instability, and there it looks like there is a sinkhole here. So, uh, in, in Jamaica, there was a sinkhole. So there is some damage from this earthquake, a 7.7, .7, and it was felt in Miami too, in the buildings. So uh, this was a pretty large earthquake, and the concern with all this earthquake activity we're seeing on this planet, uh, you know, we always see these upticks usually from time to time. Uh, the planet it means it's getting more geologically active between that and the volcanoes. It's something we definitely have to watch. So that does wrap up this update on this earthquake. And uh, let's hope no one got hurt. Take care.